be. At some point. Yeah. Evan Nicole. Yeah. Hi, my name is Lauren Octavik, and I'll be presenting you guys some magic card effects that I've learned. Some of them in my FI 100, and others I've learned on my own. So, for the first one, I'll start with a simple card effect. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take these cards. It's just a normal deck of cards, you know, all normal faces and everything. And I'm going to take them, and I'm going to make a perfect riffle shuffle. So, I'm going to take them and do it nice and slow, and try and make it as perfect as I can. All right, would somebody like to come up here and prove that these are all shuffled? All right. Gotcha. Are they shuffled together? All right, we're going to put these back together in one big pile. And this is where things get interesting. So what we're going to do is we're going to take this deck of cards, and we're going to split them in half. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to deal these into two piles. One of these piles will be yours, and one of these piles will be mine. You can choose whichever pile you'd like to be yours, whichever you'd like to be mine. It doesn't matter which one you'll choose. There's an even number of cards in each pile, and all of them have normal numbers and normal faces. So after I deal through these, I'll let you choose. Alright, which pile would you like? Alright, go ahead and take that pile. So I'm going to have you lay your cards down face up. One pile red and one pile black. And I'll put one across from yours face down. As you can see, all of these have normal faces and they're all mixed up. My color, number, doesn't matter. There's no specific order. There's no patterns. It's all magic. Something that you may not know is that cards, they like to stick together. They like to stay by cards that are similar to them. So, as you can see, this pile right here, this is your pile of red cards. All of them are red. And the pile here, this is your black cards. All of them black. But pretty crazy that the pile next to your black cards are all my black cards as well. It's pretty crazy. And would you know that uh, up next to your red cards are also my red cards? It's pretty crazy. So I wonder what else cards can do. So next, I'm going to ask if you can show me these cards. So what you might not know about cards is that when you shuffle them, a little bit of your personality rubs off on the cards and allow you to make a couple predictions about them and about you. So I'm going to go ahead and make a prediction about you right here. Mm, that one looks pretty good. I think that's a winner. Yeah. All right. Now, I can feel a little bit more of your personality still stuck in these cards, so I'm going to make one more prediction just to be safe. Mm, that one's calling my name, definitely. All right, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna shuffle up this deck of cards just to make sure that all of your personality's out of them. I'm gonna cut it into three piles. I'm gonna put them back together. Now I'm gonna lay these cards down one at a time, and you're gonna tell me when to stop. Stop. All right, I'm gonna place this card right here, face up put the rest of the deck on top of it. We're going to do that one more time. Stop. All right. So, you shuffled the cards, right? Yeah. I made two predictions based on your personality. And then I shuffled the cards, I cut the deck, and I asked you to tell me where to stop. You could have stopped between any of these cards. It's just a normal deck, right? It just so happens that you stop this red eight next to the other red eight. And this black king next to the other black king. So you must have a pretty magical personality. So we've already learned that cards can stick together and match up, and they can make predictions. So I'm going to have you shuffle this one more time, and I'll show you one more thing cards can do. So those are nice and shuffled, right? So. Just to make sure, I'm going to do what's called a pharaoh shuffle. So we're going to take the cards, move them up and down, one at a time, throughout the entire deck. 
just to make sure, make it a little trickier on the cards to do. But this trick, I'd hold your hats on and your socks and your shoes because it's going to end with a bang. It's going to be pretty crazy because these cards are special and that they do magical things more than you can know. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to flip through these cards like this a little bit slower and you're going to tell me when to stop, okay? All right, right here, see, memorize that card, look at the card, all right. I'm going to turn this, and I'm going to turn it into a gun. <laughs> Dang, get it? It's going to end with a bang. How crazy is that? All right, so I'm going to pull your card out of the deck. This is your card, right? No? Oh. Um, guess we just have to use that to shoot it out of the deck, okay? Ready? Bang. Is this your card? So we've already learned that cards can stick together and match up. They can make predictions, and they even can shoot guns. I wonder what else cards can do. Thank you.